So odd stimming behaviors and autism. In this video, I'm covering something really interesting, very odd, and you probably didn't know it was a stim. Coming up. Guys, welcome back to the Aspie world. My name is Dan, I have autism, ADHD, OCD, and dyslexia, and I make weekly videos all about this kind of stuff. So if you're new around here and you'd like to learn more, remember to hit the subscribe button here on YouTube by clicking that notification bell. But if you're watching on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok, be sure to follow this page for daily videos. Oh, before I forget, you can download my free autism life hacks PDF at autismhacks.net, completely free right now. Guys, what is going on? Oh, you know, Okay, this is funny. So let, let's break it down. So autistic people do this thing called stimming, which is short for self-stimulatory behavior. Now what that is, is you may see them flapping their hands or, or twiddling their fingers or like rocking side to side or rocking on a chair, that kind of stuff. And what self-stimulatory behavior does is it's kind of like a relaxing uh, repetitive notion that autistic people get into to regulate themselves uh, in situations of maybe heightened anxiety or heightened stress or even maybe when they're really happy and they're really content or they're really focusing on something. Now this is what stimming is. Now I know all the parents out there are nodding saying yeah yeah we know this is. So I recently came across something that I do because my son started doing it and I didn't realize it was a stim until he started doing it, but I do it. And that is shaking my eyes from side to side. Now, shaking your eyes from side to side rapidly is like a muscle spasm that you can control. Now, I know a lot of people can do this, but I actually use this as a stim, but it's a really good one because not a lot of people can see it. You know, I'm sitting there just like shaking my eyes from side to side and nobody can really see it because I'm just doing it on my own time and my own kind of in my own world. Now I never knew that this was something I was doing for stimming until my partner pointed out and said, you know, our kid is, you know, stimming when he's like shaking his eyes. And I'm like, oh my gosh, like it, it blew my mind. And then I was like, wow, I've never ever thought about it in a way where I think, hey, shaking my eyes is a form of stimming that it's not like a physical thing that you can see like me, you know, shaking my body or jumping up and down or rocking backwards and forwards or, you know, shaking my leg. All those things are, are like macro size kind of stims. But when you're like shaking your eyes quite discreetly, these are like micro stims and like these are micro size stims. So I was like, this is so profound. Now this opens a whole world of different things. I want to know, are there any stims that you do or other people do? Like, I want to know like what other things do people do that they, that they're, they're stimming, but it's kind of like condensed to this like, you know, macro kind of micro scale thing. Um, I want to know. So drop me a comment down below if you have anything similar like this that happens. And um, I, I just want to know. So definitely drop me a comment. If this was interesting and you think it could be useful for somebody, please share this video. Give it a thumbs up because it helps me. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Peace.